I have a phone addiction and I'm putting my iPhone into iPhone jail and I'm gonna use an iPad mini instead. Justin Bieber only has an iPad. Ed Sheeran, Vince Vaughn, Shailene Woodley, they all try to minimize their phone usage. I'm shocked making this video right now what I can do. Can I use this larger form factor iPhone Pro Max Extra Large Ultra instead of my iPhone? And can it minimize my social media use? My precious. See you in 24 hours. This is me waking up. Usually the first thing I'll do is check social media, but since I have an iPad, I deleted all of the social media apps. And then I wear way too many sleep trackers, so I need to check my sleep trackers. They only have iPhone apps and they look kind of funky on the iPad, but it still works. And now it's time to use the restroom. I don't know about you, but I like to mindlessly scroll when I'm sitting here. And since it's a bigger device, it's a little bit harder to take with me into this area. Let's get out of here. Yep. So I know one of the big things is whenever I enter an elevator, right, I get bored. And the first thing I want to do is pull out my phone and start watching some social media content. But since this is so big, it's a little hard to pull out of my pocket. So I'm just going to chill and do nothing. That was the longest elevator ride ever. Uh, first thing we got to get is coffee in the morning because you can't get your day started without some nice cold brew. And I'm going to open up Apple Maps right here. And we are going to find my favorite coffee shop, which is called The Grind, because we've been grinding all day. So we are going to navigate there. I'm going to tap. It's about nine minutes away. It's showing on the iPad. I can literally just follow these directions on the iPad, and we can use this as guidance. I'll hold it up and definitely not look weird while doing it. In a quarter mile, take a left on 9th Avenue. the coffee shop. Hello. Good, how about you? Could I get an iced latte decaf? So I'm gonna try to use Apple Pay, but the iPad mini doesn't have Apple Pay when you're trying to pay with like a terminal. So sadly, I gotta carry a wallet. But luckily, I got the watch. The only way that you can use Apple Pay on the iPad is on websites when you're trying to order online, but it doesn't have the NFC chip for you to pay Apple Pay like in a physical location. And now that I'm done journaling, I need to edit my thumbnail for my next video. I can go ahead and switch to Lightroom and I'll go ahead and switch to my thumbnails. Go ahead and select one that I'm currently working on right now. I can switch it to be sideways, select the subject. So I'm gonna go ahead and select myself. Lightroom will pull out what I am and then I can go ahead and actually change my exposure, my contrast. We've started to edit what this thumbnail is gonna look like. It is kind of small, but it still works, right? I'm able to select what I want to select. I can edit a portion of the photo. If I wanna go back to editing the entire photo, I can do that as well. All right, and that's like a preliminary thumbnail right there. I can export that to my phone and save it. Once I've done the title and thumbnail, I need to start taking notes for my script. So I'm gonna pull up the script for my next video, put it on top of my little monitor mount right there, and I can use my finger as a mouse. I can go ahead and type for my script. So what is the next? And realize this is a computer it's my iPhone. It's literally everything I need in this device right here. And it's transforming, right? I added it in the keyboard, I added it in the case. I have an Apple Pencil. Like there's so many things I can do with this one device. It's, it's honestly, I'm, I'm shocked making this video right now, what I can do. Maybe you don't use Apple Notes as your main editor for writing things. Microsoft and Google have all their main uh, content creation platforms on there as well. So you can use Google Docs, right? To create Word documents, edit, collaborate with anyone you need to. Maybe your work uses Microsoft Word. So Microsoft has PowerPoint, Word, Excel, all available on the iPad. And I can use my keyboard. If I had a mouse, I could use that too on this iPad mini. Yeah, and if I wanna to listen to music while I'm working, I can go ahead and open Spotify. This will connect to my AirPods. I can even multitask because this is multiple apps I can load at the same time, three different apps, right? If I wanna have my Apple Notes, my journaling, and Spotify all on the same page, I can do that on this iPad mini. Would I do it? Probably not. All right, we're done with work here, so let's head to the park and get some afternoon sunlight. All right, now that we're on the subway, you know, we all like to open up our iPhones, do some social media, 
read a book, whatever it is. The iPad, I have to actually go into my backpack and pull it out, so that's what I'm doing. And now I can like take notes, I can write, and I just have a bigger screen, which is really nice, and do whatever I really want now. Now that we made it to our station, put the iPad away. Let's get that sunlight. So there is a struggle just to get my device. I really gotta to move my backpack around, get the iPad out, and now I can figure out where we're going. Mom? Yeah, I'm in the middle of a video. Can we talk later? Yeah, yeah, okay, bye. So one of the downsides is you actually can't do regular phone calls and regular text messages on the iPad mini, but you can do FaceTime audio and FaceTime video on the iPad. Even though it has cellular, it has an eSIM, some rules, and they just didn't put SMS or regular phone calls. The workaround though is using Google Voice. I can actually go ahead and type a number in here and I can, I can call it. So now it's on speaker, and now I'm actually doing a regular voice call over the internet where the NSA can hear what I'm saying. It's it's not encrypted. I guess it's not available. That's the workaround for phone calls. And since this iPad mini extra large Pro Max is small enough for my hand, I can hold it with one hand. But there are some people who can't hold this device with one hand. But when it comes to like meeting new people and trying to get their number and their contact information, I feel like that might be kind of weird. I want to put it to the test. We're at Washington Square Park right now. Let's see if people think it's weird if I'm asking for their number using an iPad mini. I just moved here. I'm just trying to make new friends. You guys already have a full set of friends. I didn't get a number. We have to try again. Maybe we find a person that's like one instead of like a group. How you guys been? Oh, could I get your number? No. Okay, cool. How much do you guys use your phone? Clearly, I keep getting rejected, so we're just gonna ask people to take photos of me. Hey, you look like you take really good photos. Can you take a photo of me? Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, awesome, thank you. Oh, damn, okay, so I gotta do that too? There we go. Look at that, see? Do I have to pay you? Are you gonna email me an invoice? Yeah. Yeah. Is it weird to take photos on the iPad? Well, it's the first time I've done it. Oh, really? Yeah. Thank you so much. Would you mind taking a photo of me? I don't mind. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. Gotta get the right angles. Awesome. Is it weird to use this to take photos? No. No? It's okay? It's normal? Okay, thank you so much. I guess it's not that weird with a little iPad mini. I just moved here. I'm just trying to meet people. I don't know. Could I get one of your numbers? You can put a fake number in too. Is it weird to have an iPad as my main device? No, I can't. No? I want to get an iPad. Cool. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Have a good day. We did it. Hey Siri, teleport to Chipotle. I don't know about you, but I love Chipotle, so I do have a Chipotle rewards account, and I need to download the Chipotle app so that I can go ahead and they can scan my reward. Could I get a burrito bowl, please? Oh, there we go. When you're at a meal eating, um, usually people are on their phone. Check that out right there, yep. <laughs> so since my iPad is in my backpack, it's a little harder to get out, so I'm gonna eat this meal without my phone. We just finished lunch, and I have a list on here of things I need to get. We need to go run this errand real quick. If only getting to the grocery store was that fast and easy, but using the iPad mini as my grocery list, I like to jot down in my notes what I need to buy. Typically, I'd use my iPhone, but for some reason, this iPad fits perfectly on the shopping cart. What a convenience. And now I can read my grocery list while I walk around the grocery store. Hey, yeah, but gave a gentleman a real chance. Girls always want them bad like Jackson. Send a jack, I mean, feeling fantastic. Cap in the dance flow like Morse code, but it's more so for the soul. Go turn the plastic umbrella for the rain. Couple puddles with the jacket. Magic. One time for the mindset. Two times for the lady in the wine dress. With my best watch, set it with the diamonds. Can't wait till they ask me what the time is. I know. Fitness is the first step to greatness, obviously. And on the iPad, I need to do a workout. They have Apple Fitness Plus, which I'm going to use the cycling classes that you can do. You can do this on your iPhone too, but with an iPad, you get a bigger screen. It still connects to your Apple Watch. So I'm going to pick a class right here with Tyrell, and we are going to hit Let's Go. If you have a Peloton, you wouldn't want to do this, but if you have a bike where you can just place the iPad, it's much cheaper. Three, two, one. Hello. Oh, this is amazing. And it's actually automatic. I didn't even realize it legit connected to my Apple Watch. It's showing my heart rate on the iPad. I didn't have to do anything. It's like connected, the time, the calories. That's actually really cool. So the iPad will connect to the Apple Watch for fitness classes via Apple Fitness Plus. Let's do this workout, baby. 
Yo, the millions, the mission, ambition is crazy. I'm fearless, I know it, I'm made for it. I rack up the digits in minutes, I'm paid, no limits, I'm different, I'm made for it. Yo, yeah, I'm ready for whatever. Bow down, homie, y'all ain't ready for the pressure. Y'all clowns, I bet you could barely stand the weather. Okay, I'm out of breath. This is a great class. Now it's time to eat dinner, go to bed. All I can think about is when is this gonna open up, baby? It's dark outside. Woke up here and I'm like, did I actually lock this thing in there? It is, <laughs> what, what was I thinking? There are three things that I noticed that I couldn't do with my iPad that I can do with my iPhone. I try to check my glucose right here. I need an NFC chip, so there is no NFC chip. There's no Apple Pay on the iPad mini. Next is Apple Health. If I wanna sync my Apple Health data to, for example, like my Whoop strap or something, there's no Apple Health access or features on here. Even if I wanted to do iPad mini and Apple Watch, I still need an iPhone. There's like no real way around it. Placing my phone with the iPad is pretty much like, it's. I like it a lot actually. You get a bigger screen. But I think the camera piece will make it impossible not to have an iPhone for it. I love taking photos. Absolutely gorgeous here. Three different cameras. It gets high quality photos. Whereas this iPad mini has one camera and a small flash. If you have a significant other who can carry their phone and have that nice camera with them that you can use on most scenarios, it could be a workaround. I can still hold it with my large hands. Look at that. We have like less than two minutes left. And I haven't been on social media all day because I don't have those apps installed on here. And I want TikTok. No, I'm serious, I'm gonna stop. I wanna try this for an entire month, so comment a dolphin emoji down below if we get enough. Maybe I'll do 30 days of iPad only challenge. Holla. Look at that, oh. But I did a challenge where I survived with only an Apple Watch. Go watch that video, link down below. We're gonna live, we're gonna be fine.